Can you turn $25 into over $1,500 in four easy steps? Let's see if we can do it. We have another roulette system from Mick Bolton. It's called One, Two, Three Tango. It is $250 in $25 checks. Mm -hmm. Papa's got $250 in nickels. It is a step system. Step number one, we're gonna put $25 on a dozen or call them. I'm gonna pick $25. That's on a dozen. it? Yep. Are these quarters too? No. It's a four bastard. step. Because he, he always likes to cut me down to size. Yeah. He always likes to cut me. He's afraid of me DJing all the chips. Because yeah, you keep asking uh, for uh, I, more bullets. Sir. Well, I need more bullets. You always need realistic. more bullets. You don't want to be down to your last bullet, dude. It's not Nobody realistic. wants to be caught dead with one. One bullet. Well, I guess if you were caught dead gambling, with one it's bullet. okay to have one bullet. All right. Well, anyways, have you ever done the tango? Yeah. Is that a dance, right? Mm -hmm. It's also one of our popular ones. Oh. There's a popular system right there, buddy. There you go. I'll put it right there. Now, <clears throat> if it does win, mm -hmm. pocket a quarter, and then you take 25 bucks, move it if to two dozen. I'm up ten dollars. <clears throat> I love those like dancers that all like hippie, hippie, steppy stuff. Yeah, flamenco. they're all fast and you know what I mean. They're like going, you're going so fast. You yeah. think they're like they sped up the film, but they didn't. They're just like moving like the speed of. Ah, look at you, buddy. There we go. Nice. Now what do you do? So we win twenty-five bucks. You're gonna pocket the twenty-five, and then you go okay. twenty-five bucks on the two dozens. I've seen this system before. Mm -hmm. This is not many, many systems. They start out this way, but it's one, two, three. So I'm guessing yes. there's a three. Correct. One, two, three, and then last tango. Oh, one, that's one, the two, last three, tango, tango in Vegas. Yes. I think that was a movie. No? Yes. Was that a movie? Last tango in Vegas. Sure. Last tango somewhere. You can you can make that a movie for literally anywhere you go, dude. It could be the last tango in my bedroom for the moment I know. Ooh. Uh, now what? We get so to see it live. Easy. So now what you're gonna do is mm -hmm. you're gonna take 25 bucks on a column and okay. pick two corner bets of your choice. I'm gonna pick these two. There you go. Two corner bits of your choice. Yep, and two That's corner bets that touch tango. the column but not each other. So yeah. I pick 17, 19. Mm -hmm. So you technically can pick 17, 19, he picks. Oh, look what you did. 28, 32. 30, 32. Yeah, let's do this. Right. Um, if you hit the column, it's a push, you can rebet. If you hit just a corner, you pocket 225, go back to step one. That's a pushy, pushy. If you hit hey. both. If you what win happened? both, you win 300, and you go to step four. All right. Have you gotten to step four yet? Not yet. Oh, you moved that around? Yeah. I thought you reset, no? You well, don't it's reset? A push. It's a push. Push. Oh, because you pushed. Oh, it's always good to push. Pushing is good. No, it's not. Don't push. I mean, pushy, I guess pushy. it depends on what you're talking about. Yeah. You know what I mean? You don't want to like push at the train station. Oh, oh God. Damn. What a way I to push me into one. a winner. Winner circle. Just I picked <clears throat> the wrong corner. Damn. No way. Uh, thank you for picking the wrong corner, sir. I wish I got it. You just showed me the clear path. Okay, we'll okay, now we're going 25 bucks. Are you starting all over? Yep. So when you lose, you just go back to basics. Yep. Now, if you do hit the four, where it's the corner, plus that, then you do pick a column number, 25 bucks and a dozen, $10 straight up, and the split's like last tango style. Okay, no one understood what the hell you just said. You have to show it to me, sir. My, my, peeps, get there. my peeps understand. No they understand that, that, that uh, Alex speak? Yep. D-Gen talk. Yeah, yeah. There's all this really? feature on YouTube where you go know, half speed. Half speed? You know, and, you, and then you read the subtitles. Oh, really? You would be, your English would be subtitled in Korean, dude. Wouldn't that be hilarious? <laughs> I'm with you. How much did you start, 252? Yes. And by the way, Mick Malton, thank you so much, Patreon member. By the way, all of our Malton, yeah. call to action, all that stuff down below, everything, link tree right there. CTA, you work that angle, dude, yes. see? Alex is, learning, Alex is the new new CVC, or what are they, what is it? QVC. What is it? QVC. Yeah. QVC the hell out of it. Dude. Let them know what they want. Oh, ironically, we have six feet Riz just walking down the stairs. Oh, oh my God. 5'11". 5'11 Riz. 5'11 Riz? What the hell does that mean? Yikes. 5'11. Isn't that no, like Jedi, a... Uh, Jedi identifies as six feet, okay? Oh, five, oh 5'11 <laughs> as in like uh, height. height. Oh, I thought that was like a club or some shit. He identifies as six feet tall. I would too. I identify as whatever you need. Oh really? Yeah, you know I mean, I'm a, I'm a needs-based kind of guy. How come I didn't see you at the corn convention last I time? know. I, well, nobody needed me. <laughs> I'm like, I don't fill a whole lot of roles in that one. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't know what. I don't even know if I could hold the stunt, camera long enough. Stunt. Stunt something. Cocaine Noel to the main stage. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Cocaine yeah. Noel. I said no one ever. <laughs> to the main stage. Yeah. I'll be like, hey. Only cocaine. Sorry, I gotta, 
I gotta call in sick for the rest of my life, please. Thank you very much. The one time we're like, oh, you're actually calling me? Oh, I shit. know, right? <laughs> call again. in sick. Can you imagine? You get that call. That's the call you're waiting for. Oh, God. Wow, I'm just getting destroyed right yeah. now. Yeah, well, you can't lose. I've heard you can't lose on the first or third column five times in a row. I heard it's impossible. Someone out there said it's literally impossible. No, yeah. no. We might have to do another friend. We'll see what happens here, so. We'll have to find some more friends. Yeah. My initial thoughts on the system, the, the dozen compared to the one-to-one, -one, that's the tough one. That's you gotta the get out one. the gate. Because mm -hmm. you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta get out the gate, dude. <laughs> Getting out the gate, you're kind of locked out. Yeah. And now, and now really, you gotta get to the end. Now you gotta get to the end goal. I feel like that, you know, like um, as I've gotten older, it takes a minute to rev up the engine. Oh my you know god, what I'm dude! So, thanks for thanks for filling us in. Let make it. I feel like that's like this system is like similar to that. You know? Really? Once it's in motion. Up. Yeah. You know. Once it hits that special place, <laughs> then you can get moving. Once but that, that special place gets smaller and smaller as you get older. You know yeah. Right? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then you're down to one number, and you're like, crap. Then your number's not on the roulette wheel anymore. Yeah, no longer on the roulette wheel, yeah. It's some other universe. It used to be a one to one, then it became a dozen. Yeah. Now it's literally just a straight up bet. Yeah, straight up. Was, yeah, no, no, implying, no, no, I'm not even applying, dude. I'm straight <laughs> up telling you. <laughs> Wait for it, buddy. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> That's you know so I mean? funny. It's All you had to good. do was just blow air into my uh, ear. Now listen. it's like this, like, did I get enough there, sleep? Listen, caffeine? there are people out there going, you know what? This week I'm going to try a $95 baked potato. You know what I mean? Instead of like, hey, this week I'm going to get late. You know, all the generic stuff. They're like, you're winding down to the baked potato experience. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Just get crushed. <laughs> just crushed. Is that your last one? How to lose. How many did you have to lose? You started with 250, 10 in a row. Yeah, and but and just. You technically won a little bit of money because of. Sure he did. Oh, the first one. He sure. First one. Oh, he did? Get me the sure. next 250 ready. Yeah, get it ready, buddy, because this isn't going to go well. Friend number two is going to be fired up here. Yeah, friend number two is in the bathroom. He's just stealing his cash. Yeah. He's like, wait, hey, watch my stacks. You're like, I got you, buddy. I can't possibly lose 10 in a row. Oh, brutal. <laughs> yeah, friend number two comes back from the bathroom and just like, what the hell happened? I'm like, okay, you know so we got friend number two, another 250. There you go. I'm gonna commit. You're gonna commit? Yeah, there okay. we go. I'm doing uh, I'm doing the Lambert on two dozens. Something else, sort of. I'm doing the short bus to Lambert. I'm doing short uh, bus to Lambert. I'm doing to Macy. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, that makes sense. Wow, almost so close. Just you so know what the close. funny part is? I could have no. just kept betting the second dozen. I was like, nah. You could have kept betting. Yeah, I'm that guy that came to the school and visited eight times on uh, the, uh, what's that? Uh, yeah. Uh, Fibonacci. Yeah. He's like, you son go. of a bitch, David. I know, he's son of a bitch. What kind of Fibonacci crap? I should just, I don't know why I haven't been pressing him. The okay. Demata. If this loses, I'm switching to the second. Are you sure? But the yes. problem is when you go this far, you have to stay to the dozen. Yeah, because then once you, once you do switch and then it comes up where you just move from, you hate yourself. Oh my God. <laughs> So question of the video, it's been a minute since I asked this, do you switch or commit? That's the question of the video. I mean, let us know. Are we talking roulette? Oh, we're talking about roulette. Oh, okay. Yes. Different answers for different things, dude. You gotta clarify, buddy. I There's mean, you can let us know about your personal life, but a lot we're of people looking at their wife going, roulette. you know what? I think I'm gonna switch, honey. <laughs> I'm gonna be like yep. and she's like, Are we talking me or roulette? Oh, Finally. Look at you, buddy. What a wiener. See, that's why just see how I lowered my bet. Okay. Hey, what are you gonna do? Oh. Man, I should just stack it. But at least now you're out of quarter. Yep. This is money that you've won technically. I think it's much easier to go one to one, two, and then. So you have a caveat. You're gonna you're gonna share the caveat. Yeah, with I don't have a caveat. Later. So yeah. the Alex <laughs> yeah. caveat. How not to get whacked so fast. How to how to take your time. How to slow play it. Yeah. And we're not talking roulette either, are we? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Lessons in life. Ah, look at you, buddy. Out the game. I think this is where you finally hit it and show everybody what the hell happened. Have you gotten to the last tango? Not yet. Ah, oh, that's depressing. 31, 34, please, sir. Okay. Thank you. I might as well do 25, 28. Just Perfect. And I'm in. I feel like that's a win. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh, God damn. Oh, you, can't, you can't even write this stuff. I know. A roulette just gives. It just keeps. It's a game that keeps giving and giving, dude. It's like the senior citizens. The nah, they keep I'm in the love. Yeah. To each other. This is the joy. Later in life, my joy is gonna be donking you out right to the end, dude. How'd he die? 
He died a donk, dude. He loved every minute of it. All right, where, wait, you're going in the middle? Oh my God, this is where you get crushed. He died at his place that he loved the most, yeah. the roulette table. Donking it, donking it on a roulette game. Uh, it just, he just kept giving. Yep. This is where that, that last, the last dozen just starts just pounding it. Oh, or the first dozen, either one is fine. <laughs> See, you don't even. Balls. You, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't ever switch balls, dude. Stay, uh, stay the balls with the same, the same balls. Bro. I better press it up. I gotta press it up. I don't know why I'm not pressing. So let's go back to it. So yeah. we bet 25 bucks on a column. This one. If you hit the corner, you go back to step one. <laughs> you guys are all seeing this, right? Everybody's seeing this. This is just too good, dude. This is just too good. At the end, I'll show you the Yeah, just well, just give me the caveat. Because right it's, now, this is just a it's BDSM. Stick followed by carrot. Masochism session. Yeah, this is tough. This is this is rough for you, buddy. I'm glad you switched, though. That worked out nice. Mm. Perfect. See, I don't even have to talk. Dude. Roulette just gives. It's a giving. Oh, look at you, buddy. You're out the gate. Oh, finally. Congratulations. Great. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Let them know what mm. they want. Mm -hmm. Then do two dozens. Mm hmm. And at least now, what are, you, what are you down to? What's brand number two looking like? Eh, that's, that's funny. That's a couple, that's a, that's like two Bacchanal buffets. I've heard the Bacchanal buffet has actually gotten better. I've Is heard the true? opposite. Really? I've heard it's gotten worse. Wow, I went, I went, someone, someone went the other day and I, oh really? Oh, that makes sense. Jeez. I've heard the opposite. It's gotten just... worse. Should we both play the same strategy? Nah. Nah, we'll let you, I'll just keep donking it out. You're it's too a, much fun to donk it out. You're just a free spirit, there. sir. No, know? I love, I love being free. I yeah. love being free. I don't know about the spirit part, but damn. You're just a free spirit, sir. All right, well, here, what do you got going on over there? Slow that's your, wheel. that's your, we're gonna slow the wheel down. So we take his money a little slower, that's not the goal. We no, don't wanna like, oh, he's changing the speed of the wheel, dude. He's trying to give you a little, uh, yep, little pump of the pump. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I swear to God, I don't think anything's gonna happen with this one. I think you just, I think you're, uh, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know, I just dial it in. This is where you call your mother for emotional support. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're like, mom? I agree with that, because uh, uh, this help. is not panning out. Your thoughts, I would say your thoughts are. Six to midnight? <laughs> I don't want to spoil the ending. Yeah, don't spoil the ending. <laughs> we got a big finish coming up, everybody. We, oh, know, yeah. we know how it ends. We're sitting here, we just know how it ends. Oh, damn it. <laughs> and there's that guy out there who wins a hundred thousand dollars a year betting the first and the third dozens on a, on American Roulette, dude. He'll tell you. He'll tell you. Yeah, I don't it's know. It's impossible. What you just experienced is not possible. It's not possible. There's literally like at this point, Alex is like, yeah. I, I love how Alex gets. He he gets so invested. I am. This, he really wants to win. I mean, he really wants every system. I want the to secret win. sauce. He just know? yeah. We all want secret sauce. Well. Some of us want more secret sauce, some of us like less secret sauce. Depends on Double up. what's in the sauce, how secret it is, what kind of recipe we're talking. I'm interested in trying yeah. your French toast though, I'm in. I'll make French toast for you guys. What I need to do is make everybody, I would, I try to make him a peanut butter and jelly sandwich to show the ratio, because I am just a genius at the ratio. I mean, that's my skill. I can boil water and make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. You know, strangely enough, I, I work with this, believe it or not, this Armenian chef taught me how to make French toast. Oh, really? And I can make a mean French toast, swear to God. It's all in the dip. It's all in the soak. It it's is. Well, besides the batter. Wait, yeah. wait, don't steal my money. Dude. I do my heavy cream God. in mine. Okay, I don't even know how to address that on this channel. So you like, we really like yours with heavy cream, Yeah, sir. because you can't put French toast in We have some heavy cream. Milk. Oh, I, no, I know, I get that, dude. So you make it as fatty as possible. Yes. That's so listen, you gotta go bad. work out and you yes. gotta hit some, you gotta do some hiking once yes. you eat your French toast. Yes, French toast. Don't. You, don't, you don't mess with, there's no such thing as organic, sugar-free, fat-free, that's not even French toast. No. That's just, I, I that's just too fiddle-diddle. A little bit of vanilla extract, a little bit of orange yeah. peel. Oh, God, Cinnamon, really? Oh, now I'm in, dude. See, I don't, there's, there's certain things in life that I feel like you can't, like buckwheat pancakes. You know what I mean? Like, I don't want a two-day pancake. Did you ever see buckwheat? Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't want to, I mean, you know what I mean? No, I get that. It's like the, we talked about Asian people with brown rice. Nobody, no Asian people with brown rice. Really? No. They serve it at P.F. Chang, don't they? That's no. for your people. <laughs> My people. <laughs> I just, I'm just always like. Who eats some... at PF Chang's, by the way? I mean, I can't. I when the last I, time I, I ate there, there I ate there the other day at the food court. It's, 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 it's always the busiest. All the places I go, it's like the busiest food court destination. You know what I mean? 
Oh, dude. God, I swear to God. <laughs> That's why I pressed it up there. That's automatic win right okay. there, buddy. You still have two bullets. You still it's have two over. bullets. It's, it's not over. over. I just feel like there's certain things in life, like... Can you throw me a green? Like, I need another. You just, you missed, uh, you missed here. You missed size, buddy. You screwed me out of my uh, nickel. The last time I went what was PF. Like the no, last I time I went shit. ate PF Chang's with you was 2019. PF Chang's. We tried to go to PF Chang's the other day and it was, uh, it was still awful. I, Cause I, years ago I thought, I've been to one where I love the, the lo mein, the noodles, but I don't know what the hell they, they threw out that recipe apparently. It's been apparently. four years since I've been it was terrible. to PF Chang's. And you know what Red Lobster, I went to Red Lobster the other day and also it was just, oh uh, God, it was just in the benches. The whole place has been like dumbed down, dialed down. Yeah. I feel like you gotta, you, the minute you walk in, they should just wrap a bib around you. It's so no. tacky. Now the problem is you guys been eating oh, all these bougie God. restaurants. I mean, what are you gonna do? Not anymore. We're, we 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 got this farm fresh to you stuff now, so we're getting salads, dude. I mean, yeah. the salads. Okay. Oh, I just broke even on that. Ooh, shit. you're down to your last thing. Yeah, I'm down to my last bullet. But don't you think there's some foods that you shouldn't, that should not be like, you know, that that should be as they come. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Like like I get people want to get healthy, organic, but you know who wants like flaxseed pancakes, dude. Like, why eat pancakes? At that point, just dip into the flaxseed. My mother gets a spoon and she goes right into the flesh. She needs one spoonful. Just work out more. You know what I'm saying? Yikes, yeah, dude, that wasn't gonna, wow. You can't even get out the pancake. Yep. All right, what's your, uh, <laughs> your thoughts, sir? Okay, my only caveat for you guys, let me show them the system all the way. Can you just give me some green? Yeah. Thank you. Let's just walk through the system. I'll show you my caveat and then let's do the rating on it. Okay. okay. All right, so now you put 25 bucks on the dozen when it wins. You'll take 25 bucks back. You're gonna go to the two dozens. You win again. You're gonna take 25 bucks and pick two column numbers that are not touching. If you hit any of those four down the middle with the column, you go to step four. If you hit the other four that are corner beds, you go back to step one. Now, if you actually do somehow hit the corner bed that's down the middle plus this, what you're gonna do next is you're going to pick a middle column 25 bucks on the dozen, and then can you give me $10 in red chips, sir? And so you're gonna take 50 bucks, so it's a $100 bet. Just so it's a $100 sure. bet, you put 25 bucks here, 25 bucks here, and then you, let's say you pick 29. Pick the number and the four splits around it. Last tango style. The goal is to take 200 back, start over, and then go. That's okay. step number four. Wow, but getting out the gate, as we saw, could be a little bit rough. Yes, the the initial warm up. You need a you need a carrot probe. Yep. Kind of prod you out. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, do have a grading scale. Durian is the worst. Then eggplant. Then plum. Then peach. Then grapefruit. Give us your thoughts. Um, I just don't see how to get to less tangle more than like getting lucky. This is one of those systems, again, where it's like, if you feel you're just gonna get lucky, bet to be lucky. You know what I mean? Like, I, I that's the thing with some of the step systems, like, as, it, you know, maybe if you started with two dozens, right? You give yourself a one dozen, man, too, too many ways for it to just, you can sit there just giving, making a donation, you know what I mean? Um, that's my caveat. All right, ready for a rating? Uh, yeah, I'm ready for okay. you, buddy. On three, one, two, three. Grapefruit. Oh, eggplant? No, I, I meant eggplant, but I'm not grapefruit. I don't know why I said grapefruit. I, I forgot to look at the dance chart. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say eggplant. I'm, here, let's do it again, do it again. Ready? Let's give it a rating. One, no, two, three, eggplant. We're gonna keep that editing out. <laughs> I didn't mean grapefruit. I just said it sucked. I meant I meant eggplant, dude. Damn it, I got that confused. This is what That's happened. A lie. Um, Twenty-five <laughs> bucks on the dozen to start is tough. If you did a one-to-one, -one, then two dozens, that makes sense to me. And I think the other part too is it, 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 the probability of you being able to go through that, Meg Malton. We appreciate you as a Patreon member. It just we seems do. very unlikely that it's, you're gonna hit this. Yeah, I don't. I don't and see it just, this. Yeah, it's, it's an eggplant. I said eggplant. I meant okay. to say eggplant. No, I, don't I forgot you. to look at my chart. There you go. All right, thank you guys so much. More videos in the corner. Hit that like button. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. And then uh, off to Kino to uh, unwind. Well the, well, the truth is, 